we continue, we're gonna do the side quest because we need EXP badly. I'm guessing we're gonna be reaching level 71 quest soon. So, Wilford, what do you got for me, dude? Wilford has the expression of a man awaiting imminent disaster. Excuse me, but I was wondering if you could help. One of the merchants from Mord Sook is on his way, bearing much-needed supplies. The problem is, the wares we are offering in exchange have yet to arrive. If it were anyone else, they could have been persuaded to wait, but this particular Mord has a reputation for being extremely impatient. He has even been known to call off deals over the smallest of quibbles. I'd be grateful if you could find out what's caused this delay. While you search for the porter, I'll try to buy some time. Many thanks. The delivery is expected to come from the southwest. Godspeed. Alright, we'll accept all the quests first, so that way we know what we're expecting. Lamont has a job to do, and he is hoping you'll do it for him. <laughs> Looking for work by any chance? I suppose I'm supposed to be draining water out of the plants with these siphons, but I could use some help. As you probably noticed, the whole area is lousy with all sorts of hostile creatures, which means this is not the job for the faint of heart. I'd be fine if siphoning water didn't take so long. While I'm waiting, I'm easy prey. If you could go in my place, I'll see that you're properly rewarded. Bleary-eyed guard. The bleary-eyed guard appears to be suffering from a lack of sleep. You're one of Alizé's friends, aren't you? I hear you lot have a knack for putting down troublesome beasts. I'm not sure if that includes the supernatural, but walking... I'm assuming that's supposed to be corpses, that's a typo. But walking corpses known as gillmen have been running amok outside the south entrance. They grab anyone who wanders too close and drag them under the sand. I almost fell victim to them myself and was lucky to escape. The thing is, I dropped my mother's pendant as I fled, and I'll do anything to get it back. She was a patient here, you see, and it's all I have to remember her by. Luckily, we found that the enchanted dart shot from a blowgun sent the gillmen back to whichever hell they crawled from. My plan is to rush in and grab the pendant while you shoot those undead bastards from a distance. So will you help me? Oh boy. I knew you would. Come on, let's get this over with. Give me a minute. So I'm gonna go accept this quest. Renric has more than his share of concerns. The moral of his men, chief among them. Morale of his men. Psst, do you have a moment? Please keep this to yourself, but one of my men has been acting strangely of late. As I'm sure you can appreciate, there are certain things that the guards here, myself included, may not wish to discuss openly. I hope that you, as an outsider, may be able to find out what is troubling him. He is currently stationed a short distance south from here. If you could lend him your ear, I'd be most grateful. I'm fairly certain I dropped the pendant by those ruins over there. As soon as I found it, I'll race back to the inn. In the meantime, I'll need you to keep the gil gilman off my back. Here goes nothing. I don't want to do this. Dude's going to die because of me. If any gilman appears, shoot them with the enchanted darts. You may move the camera as well as zoom in and out. Target the gilman and use the blowgun with R2 and or X. Did I fail? I failed. Sorry, I'm not good at these. Oh, come on. It's as close as I can zoom in. These things I think are really hard on a controller. <laughs> I really don't like them. I told you, the Warrior of Light's gonna kill this dude. Did I do it? Did you dependent? Are we done? 
Okay, good. It looks like we're done with that. All right. Sorry, come here. I'm not gonna disturb those lovely people. All right. Bladed Porter. Ah, oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. Is there something you want? Oh, it's Tentacle Kitty. It's one of my guildmates. Didn't even notice. Wilfred sent you? Bloody hells, am I that far behind schedule? Anyways, these sacks contain half of our half of the deal. Well, maybe a bit more than that. I got carried away and brought too much to carry by myself. It's a miracle I made it this far. Do you think you could help me cover the last stretch of the journey? Not far to go now. And these things are heavy, so watch your back. Remember, bend at the knees. Oh, no. Transport. No! I don't wanna! No! I hate things like this. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, in there, okay. Where am I? How did I get myself so lost? Where's my timer? I got 20 seconds. Fifteen! Ten! Where are you? What? I had them! My goodness, are you kidding? I had them! Yeah, yeah, I dropped it. Let's go. Late, late, late. If your friend did not pour such delicious tea, I would have taken my words back to Mord Sook. Next time you won't be so lucky. <laughs> that was a near thing if I ever saw one. I dread to think what we'd do without these supplies. Although I must say, I didn't expect you to end up carrying the goods here yourself. That sack was full of a Toby Briggs, you know. Considering that you only made... That they're only made with clay mixed in strong water, they last an incredibly long time clay water and st straw. Even those excavated from the ruins are still perfectly adequate for building work. In fact, the Mord plan to use them in repairing their windmills. Still, bricks are bricks, far from the easiest thing to carry over long distances. Perhaps next time we'll send more than one person to transport them. Now that I think about it, this whole thing was very poorly planned. We're very lucky we had you to help us on this occasion. Hopefully it won't happen again. Haha, <laughs> they didn't like that very much, did they? And best of all, I got the pendant. Do you know, I've never seen such fine aim with a bloke. <laughs> the secret, though, lies in the darts. They were excavated from the ruins of Nabath, Iran. According to the historians, these same darts were used by the Nabath to destroy Gilman all those years ago. There were whole stockpiles of the things, in fact. Anyway, that's good enough about- that's enough about ancient history for one day. And more importantly, I'd like to thank you for all you've done. Please accept this as thanks and give Alice a my regards. Oh, it's close. That lizard turned at just the right time. Oh, that's right. I'm siphoning plants. Uh, brass siphon. Timid guard. What brings you all? Brings you all the way out here? So you've been talking to Wen Renrick. Well, if you must know, I was thinking about leaving this place. It's all getting too much for me, and I felt like I was losing my mind one day at a time. Me and one of the others were planning on making a clean break, putting the inn behind us. But after seeing you and Alice say, I changed my mind. I'm staying here, at least for the time being. Could you give, my mes to, could you give a message to my friend? He's the one I was going to run away with. The gal... Gal... Gent chap. I'm not exactly sure where they'll be, but the watchman southeast of the inn should know. Tell him I'm staying. I'd go myself, but I can't abandon my post. Please, I've got to let him know.
Nonchalant watchman. Gadgets and bloke on patrol. You just missed him, I'm afraid. Said he wanted a breath of fresh air, so he went for a stroll. I tried telling him there's no, no, there's no fresher up there than it is here, but would he listen? He would he bollocks. Anyway, I last saw him, he was heading north. Nope. I just have no desire in fighting a whole bunch of little enemies that give me 2,000 experience. Fallen guard. Uh oh. Is he dead? I remember you, one of Alize's friends. Staying? I thought so. That's why I left, by myself. Reckoned I'd get a bit further before being attacked by beasts, though. Just my bloody luck. Can you tell him? I went alone, that I got away. I wouldn't want him to blame himself. It's my own fault. He was set on staying, but I talked him into leaving. I should have listened. Is he dead? There's no response. It's just a corpse. Well... Alrighty then. So, did you give him the message? <sighs> well, I'm glad he didn't stay on my account. I wouldn't want him to hold him back from finding a new life elsewhere. Still, I stand by my decision. It's the right thing to do, I know it. Come to think of it, Renrick is probably wondering what's going on. If not too much to ask, would you mind speaking with him? Sometimes a lie is kinder than the truth. Did I do it right? Very impressive. Are you sure you haven't done this before? Now you might be wondering why we'd go through the effort of siphoning from plants. There are easier ways to get water after all. Well this stuff is a certain sweetness that comes in handy when making medicines. They tend to taste quite bitter, so this takes the edge off. Not that it makes the treatments any more effective, but the patients certainly seem to appreciate it. You have our thanks. Is that so? <laughs> it is better than both of them being killed. We should be thankful for small mercies. In any case, I appreciate what you've done for us. Alright. So that's all the side quests in this area so far. We've got more over here, obviously. Holy crap. This map is huge! <laughs> 